Good morning, everyone. We are continuing here in the Kitzvah Shulchan Aruch in the Halachas of Erev Pesach that falls out on Shabbos. And he writes over here the following very important halacha because we have to have Shabbos, we have to eat meals. And it has to be done by a certain amount of time to make sure that we don't transgress having chametz too late. So it says like this, On Shabbos morning, we must daven early. Not only must we daven early, you can't schlep out the davening. There's no singing, there's no drushes. Well, there's not a lot of singing, and certainly there's no drushes. We daven and we go home because we have to eat the meals. Shalola acher hazman, in order that we do not miss the time, shemutan ba'achilas chametz, that you're allowed to eat chametz. V'nochayin l'chalik sudasar l'shtayim. And it is appropriate to divide up the meal into two. Da'ayin shiyavarech b'chaz ha'mazayin. First you have your first meal, and that will count as your morning suda, and then you make, you say birchas amazon, you bench, you make the grace after the meals, and then a mat, you have to take a little bit of a break in between, either ba'alicha, you go for a walk, or b'divrei Torah, or you say over some, you learn, you say Torah, or b'tiyul, some other kind of recreational thing, you play a game of cards, or something like that, then then you wash your hands once again, you eat a little bit, and you make birchas amazon one more time. Because that that um, that second meal now is going to be considered the third Shabbos meal, right? You had one on Friday night, now you had one in the morning. You took a little bit of a break over here, and now you are and now you are eating the third meal. However, it should be noted that this is not the lechachil way. For a person to eat three meals, really, in reality, the third meal should always be six and a half hours after the day has begun. And it's not going to happen over here on this Shabbos because it's so early. Because, in the, just to tell you the timing, these are the Los Angeles times. If you're someplace else, please check your local calendar. Do not go by these times. But the final time for a person to eat chametz on Shabbos, this, this Shabbos coming up, the final time you eat chametz is two times. The Magen Avram is the earlier time, 1029, and the Vilna Gain is 1054. So according, according to the Vilna Gain, after 1054, you are no longer allowed to eat chametz. That is well within six and a half hours from daybreak. Imagine Nate's is going to be around 630, 640. So six and a half hours later is, is not till one o'clock. So since that you cannot fulfill the mitzvah of Shalash Shudas in the best possible way, so the uh, Mishnah Brewer brings down that a person should, after six and a half hours in the day, they should eat something and have in mind Shalash Shudas, either meat or fish, or at least, if not that, some pears, some fruits, and they should have in mind that I'm fulfilling the mitzvah of Shalash if it didn't count the first time around. Okay, so that is the that is halacha, and and that is the way that we're going to do things on this very special, unique Shabbat that's coming up. That means you, please be in touch and in contact with your shuls where you daven, see when the minion is going to be. If you normally you daven at 8.30 on the Shabbos morning, it's certainly going to be much earlier than that. Some people daven in Nates, some people are planning to daven at 7 o'clock in the morning, how, whichever way it's done, please be aware of the times and know again that the last time the chametz is 10.54 according to the Vilna Gain, 10.29 according to the Magen Avram, all here in Los Angeles times, and the time of Bir chametz of the burning of the, or the, not the burning, the, the, the um, bittel, or the disposing of the chametz, which means whatever is left, we flush it down the toilet as we said, we get rid of it to the best of our abilities, and then we nullify it, that's all going to be by uh, 10, 11, 44, according to the Magen Avram, and 11.56, according to the Vilna Gain. Have a wonderful day, and Be'ez Hashem, we shall see you tomorrow. All the best.